Unlimited LA narrates robbery incident in New York. Some of them wanna wine for me. Some of them boogie down for me. We love the way the ladies are wine for me. Everybody Remember some time back in September, award-winning cinematographer Unlimited LA who was in New York City for an event, was robbed of his valuables, which cost him over a million naira. The director, who is putting out a short film soon, recounts his ordeal and reveals to Hip TV how it all happened. Okay, after, after the event, where I was announced the like, best director for um, Nigeria Entertainment Award, and the next day I checked out from my hotel, um, a friend came to pick me up and we went, we drove from Manhattan, we drove all the way to Brooklyn to go check out some location because I was supposed to shoot a video there. Uh, we checked out the location, it was nice, blah, blah, blah. Then when we got back to the car, I discovered that all my stuff was gone. Like everything that I came into the United States with, like my bag, my laptop, cameras, lenses, my clothes, everything, you know plus cash and my passport, everything gone like that. I, I could not cry because I'd be like, wait, this is, this is America now, what's going on? This is America, this has never happened to me in my own country, but this is America. But uh, thank God, I just, I went to Nigeria Embassy, I saw two women, two great women, and they helped me. And in two days, they gave me a traveling document and I came back to the country. It wasn't, it wasn't like, planned I, I know because we drove if you know the distance between Manhattan and 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 and, and um, Brooklyn it's like it's like moving from Ikeja to Aja you know it's, the distance is just too far apart for somebody to just tell me and it was traffic and all that it wasn't planned it was just it was just one of those things that happened on the streets of Brooklyn <laughs> Find out three artists that was the most challenging to work with and three that were easy for Unlimited LA. Three artists that gave me, um, that were challenging for me. But number one, I would say Black Magic. As in me and Black Magic, we literally fight on set, sometimes during edits. By the end of the day, we just say, you, come off for there, and I saw you could do, for you know, we're happy again, video is out, everybody's, everybody's happy. That would, number one will be black magic. Number one will be black magic. And secondly, will be um, 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 DJ. <laughs> you know what DJ is that? DJ will, oh God. DJ, DJ won't talk. But you can see on her face that Ellie, really, I really don't want to do this. Maybe she doesn't want to open her body or she's not comfortable with particular clothes. And like that. I totally understand that. But sometimes, you know, you just, I'm like, DJ, can you just show some skin? Like, small. She's like, no. Okay. And the third will be, um, <clears throat> will be now who, 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 Timaya. <laughs> Timaya, Timaya is just one comedian on the set. Timaya wants to see every take. If it's a close up, it's wide. If it's, he wants to see, he wants you to play back every take for him. And sometimes he wastes my time, you know, like, like how can I be doing play back on every take? You're spending time here. And three artists that I know that is always a smooth ride with them. Number one will be Olamide. Olamide doesn't even care. Olamide will just say, Ellie, this is the song I want to shoot on the set to just shoot. Even to the extent that Olamide will tell me, it's enough. Like, he doesn't want to shoot anymore. Like, can, can we just wrap it up and go? I'll be like, no, let's just shoot two, two more scenes and all that. Olamide is number one. And first cut is good with Olamide. Olamide just collect the first cut, release straight. And secondly will be Young Six. Young Six is a one take artist. You know, like, like any, if it's a close up, if it's a wide, any scene, Young Six. It's one take. You, you record one, young six, one take, and you're good to go. The third would be Sean Tizzle. You know, because Sean is, Sean is always ready. Like, Sean can already visualize how he's going to look. So when the scene comes, he's just, he's always, Sean, Sean Tizzle is a one take artist. You know, yes, those are my three smooth ride and three, <laughs> no, I wouldn't say difficult, but challenging artists that I've ever worked with.